Hi everyone, uh, welcome to my video of the Dragon 35th scale 101st Airborne Bulge Diorama. Um, I had this kit in my stash for a very long time and I decided finally to make it. Um, the box art is, is wonderful and it really inspired me to do a mini diorama complete with snow and background. The base was actually a picture frame that I bought at Big W, a department store here in Australia. Um, I was able to fill in most of it with balsa wood and then I covered up with um, Plaster Paris and uh, painted it to give a snow background. Before I did any of the painting on the figures, I had to make sure that the poses were spot on and the rifles fit in perfectly. Um, also, I made sure that uh, the base uh, was proportioned so that they could all fit on in an effective way. As there were four figures, uh, it made it very easy to paint them all together. I did that right up to the facial features and then the last bits and pieces I worked on individually. Uh, the sculpt of the dragon figures were really, really good and had a, a, f a fair amount of character. When painting 35th scale models, uh, especially with the faces, um, I decide not to put any whites in their eyes and just give them a basic shade and let the sculpt do the rest. And it turned out very realistically, I felt. With their uniforms, I just use the three basic shades, uh, the initial shade of the uniform plus a, um, a dark wash and uh, a highlight lighter being dry brushed on it. The slings for the rifles were made out of thick paper and I used resource material as reference and I felt that putting in this detail gave it much more deep, much more effectiveness. The only real disappointment with the figures was that the bottom of the uh, great coats didn't quite uh, fit and there was quite a bit of gap on both figures with the great coats. I put in some thick paper and filled up the rest with putty and fortunately it didn't um, cause much of a problem.
the title that I used was actually cut off the box art from the kit. To end up the diorama, what I did was I had an acrylic background made and it was bent to 90 degrees and I found a couple of pictures of snowy uh, forests which I picked out the best one to suit the figures. And that's it. I hope you enjoy the diorama. Thank you.